Greetings and welcome back to Here's What I Heard. I'm Laura Degatis, your hostess. I feel a rant coming on. I've been working on video for Saturday and it's almost finished. I'm so happy this one took me a long time. But I'm thinking you'll enjoy it. You'll at least laugh once or twice maybe. <laughs> There's a little secret in there for you too. However, waking up and having my coffee this morning, I'm reading and seeing everybody calling the president a liar again. Here we go again with this stuff. Um, I have one question for anybody actually. Do you want a panicked president? Do you want a panicked leader? You want somebody to get up there and go, Oh my God, we're all going to die. Even though it's actually true, but it's nothing to panic about. Why would you be upset about a president not creating any more havoc than was going on at the time? Does anybody not remember the empty shelves? Does anybody not remember not being able to get toilet paper? Does anybody not remember being a not being able to get masks or um, disinfectants or even alcohol? Are you people insane? Not to mention the fact that I don't understand why nobody has heard the fact that the other side keeps talking about how bad of a job he did while they basically blocked him at every turn, no matter what he tried to do. You're not even listening to your own experts that you're talking to, that you're making everybody listen to, which, as you can tell, don't know anything either. Now, this is ridiculous, and I, this is one of the reasons why I started doing this. It's absolutely insane. I'm tired of being treated like a child. I've been on this earth long enough, and I've seen enough of these things to know it's bullshit. All they can, if all they can do is sit there and call the president a liar all day long, every day. You know, nobody is that consistent. Even a, blo even a broken clock is right twice a day. You wonder why all of this stuff is going on? It's because your hatred... You literally, like I said with the Bill Maher thing, I, I think he started it with this crapola. You literally are willing to sacrifice other people that probably would be willing to stretch a hand out to you to go against one man. Now, I'm not sure who I heard say this, but this stuff needs to stop. It needs to stop. You guys are, have begun, it's beyond ridiculous. They've literally turned the judicial system and the, and the, and the voting system and, and the two parties and everything else into, you want to call him a reality TV show host? You guys are acting just like it. While he's up there trying real hard to protect you and your rights to do so. I, ha I hear people that are predicting that this race thing isn't going to turn out nice. Especially since it's such crap. Alright, well, end of rant. I tried not to take too much time on this. Make sure you're taking care of me. I really need the support. As do the rest of us that have been fed up with this stuff and haven't had a chance or been able to say anything until now. So, my links are below. Thanks for listening, everybody. Thanks for clicking on my little acre of the internet, even though this was another rant. I hate to do these, but... I think they're necessary, and actually, they feel pretty good once I'm done. 
Y'all should do the same thing. Hit me up, y'all. Until next time.